Hey everybody, welcome to the Head Startup. On today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to embed Google Maps onto your Shopify contacts page. Um, so there's only a couple of quick steps to do it. So it makes your page look a lot more professional rather than having just text detail about your addresses. Um, I think it makes it look a lot better. So let's get to it. As you can see here, I have my current contacts page here with no map on it. So we're going to update this together. So this is just the preview. So I'm just going to close this preview now. And I'm assuming you already have a contacts page. So if you want to just go to your pages and then go to your contact page, open up the, the, the detail. Okay, so this brings up the text box where you enter your text, but we need to change this now to the HTML view in order to um, input the map. So if you just come here to this button in the top right hand corner, it's a show HTML button. This will change it to the HTML code that um, is currently there. Um, so we need to go now and find the code for the map to embed it here with this code that's already here in the, on the Shopify page. So I'm going to go to Google Maps. So you enter your zip code into Google Maps, um, and then this will bring up a few options here. So you want to go to share when um, when you have your address, and then you'll see this option embed a map. And this will bring up the code here, and you'll see copy HTML. So this will be all the code you need. And we'll come back to our page here on Shopify, and we're going to put this in right at the bottom of our page. So I pasted that in just straight from Google Maps, and now I'm going to hit save. Okay, so now we should be able to preview our page. So I'm just going to go back out here, and we're going to preview this page to make sure it's after updating correctly. Perfect, our map is after feeding in here nicely now onto our contacts page. Um, so that's pretty much it, and there's not much else to it. So I hope you enjoyed the video and it was somewhat helpful. If you did, um, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for future tips like this. Thanks very much.